Hello, my friends. Today we're playing Crawling Back to You from Tom Petty. We've got a full capo on the third fret. We're going to learn some new chords, so get ready for a fun little ride. veteran friends and all my friends that have tuned in to learn how to play this little bit melancholy but somewhat hopeful song from the late great Tom Petty. So the first thing you may notice is I've got a full capo on the third fret and if you want to play along with the original uh, you'll want a capo on the fifth fret uh, but though I can sing it um, at the pitch that Tom Petty does, it's a little bit of a strain for me, so I move it down um, from the fifth to the third fret, move the capo down. Okay, let's talk about the chords. So we've got some things called add nine, add five, minor seventh. Those all sound like, oh my God, what are these jazz chords? These are gonna be hard. All they really are, are um, the fact that I'm maintaining this note right here, the first string fretted three frets above the capo. So the first chord is an F add nine. Okay, now what I do when I play an F is I use my thumb um, on the first fret of the sixth string to get that deep bass note. Um, in this case, it would be really hard to play a, I think impossible actually to play a full bar F and, and get that note in there cleanly anyway. So. Um, what I'm recommending is 
um, using your um, ring finger on uh, string four, three frets above the capo, middle finger, string three, two frets above the capo, index finger uh, on string two, first fret, and then you've got your pinky on that first string, third fret. So if you wanted to just play uh, four, or excuse me, five strings there, starting with the fifth string, you could do it that way. Now I add that thumb in there to get that bass note. Okay. So that is the F add nine, playing all six strings. Now the next chord is an A minor seventh, but all you really need to do is keep that pinky where it is on the first string, third fret and move to this A minor shape. Very familiar beginning chord shape, but we're playing the A minor seventh version to maintain that. It's almost like a droning effect, this um, fretted first string on the third fret. So we've got the F add nine, A minor seventh. Then we go to a G, and then back to the F add nine, and then we repeat it again. So that's pretty much 90% of the song right there. F add 9, A minor 7, 2 and G, back to the F add 9. Strum pattern is pretty much a down up, 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 down up. Now what I'm doing is I'm um, plucking a bass note on the first down. Okay, so that's um, the chords and the strum pattern for the uh, verses. The chorus is uh, same. Hacking. We switch it up in the bridge, which is after the second chorus. So we go from that F add nine, hey baby, to a C add five, which is just a C underneath that pinky on the uh, first string, third fret. So hey baby, there's something in your eyes trying to say to me that I'm gonna be all right. And then down to the A minor seventh, if I believe to an E minor, believe, to a G and U, A minor 7th, that's all, to an E minor, I want to G. So we'll finish up with the last two verses and a chorus. It was me and my sidekick He was drunk and I was sick We were caught up in a ballroom fight Till an Indian shot out the lights I'm so tired of being tired Sure as night will follow day Most things I worry about Yes, and one thing I forgot to mention is that little hammer on that I do on the F add 9 with the middle finger. So starting off with the open third string and then hammering into it on the second fret. Just 
adds a little a little something something a little texture to that F chord F add nine chord so anyway I hope you guys enjoy singing and playing Crawling Back to You by Tom Petty have a wonderful week and look forward to sending you another lesson very soon until then Adios, my friends.